Hello, Jose Zayas here for your update on Wednesday, June the 24th. It is officially summer. Yes, the sun is shining most of the time and it is not raining and we're all smiling again. And so we're hitting our summer and our summer rhythms as a church. Now, I want to give you an update on our reopening plans for gatherings that are live. Remember, the church is never closed. We're always open. We are the church. Yet, we want to take steps towards being together live. I'll give you a side example. Our elders have met all on Zoom and then we met live just this last time. And I can't tell you what a huge difference it was. Same people, same ideas, same prayer, same everything, but being in the same room together was so much more life-giving. Now, because of Kate Brown's announcement last week, which many of you know, our county, Washington County, is now put in with Multnomah and Clackamas, we're one region, which is slowing down us going towards phase two. Not a problem. Why? We are guided by the Holy Spirit. We're guided by a compass, not a clock. But here's the next step I'm asking you to take. As of today, we are opening it up for our su uh, summer rhythms for our community groups. Normally, we give our group leaders the summer off and say, totally chill, relax. And we, you know, reintegrate in the fall. But we've asked them, and at least 13 or so, they said, you know what? We're open to gathering with our group this summer. So you're saying, Jose, I'm not in a community group you can sign up now. Now it's gonna look different than our normal. Our normal is seven weeks in a row every week. But because it's summer and people going away on vacation or all sorts of things, every group is figuring out how often, when, and what their meetings will look like. For some, it still may be social distance, it still may be Zoom. For others, it may be outside in a park or in a, in a large yard. And we're asking our leaders to stick with the guidelines given to us by the state. We wanna honor uh, God's leaders that he's put above us. So if you're not in a group, sign up today. If you are in a group, connect with your group leader to find out. Maybe it's once a month, maybe it's twice a month, maybe it's the guys one week and the ladies another week. Each group is gonna figure it out. We're gonna do it in the spirit of love and grace. I will continue to keep you updated on when will our first opening you know, of live gatherings happen. But until then, uh, let's continue in our series this Sunday on the way of Jesus.